Good afternoon. I'm Erin Conrad. Here are your trending stories in green country today. Another victim is coming forward from the University of Oklahoma claiming the school's former vice president sexually assaulted them. This is the second abuse allegation Trip Hall is now facing. Court documents show the 24 year old OU graduate reported being assaulted several times while he worked as a bartender at the university club in Norman. University officials are expected to deliver a formal statement on these allegations sometime later today. And if your home or business was damaged during the flooding, you could get a break on your property taxes. An Oklahoma statute allows for property that has been damaged in a storm to be reassessed for the year at the fair cash value of that property. If you believe you qualify, you should contact the Tulsa County Assessor's Office. And Tulsa police say a woman shot a man in the torso and left him on I-244 this morning. Police say it happened in the eastbound lanes of I-244 near Mingo and Admiral. A witness told police they saw a woman and a man struggle outside an SUV when then the woman drove off. A witness went to check on the man and found that he was shot. Officers say they do have a person of interest, but no arrests have been made. Now here's a quick check of the forecast. Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist Brandon Woolley tracking the hottest weather of the year so far coming in over the next couple of days. The first day of summer is Friday and you guessed it, more rain showers and thunderstorms moving on in with morning lows by tomorrow into the 60s too close to 70 degrees in a few locations 63 in Bartlesville 68 in Bristow and 66 out to the east in Pryor. Then we talk about the heat indices tomorrow afternoon and throughout the early evening already a ozone alert for green country. Those heat indices from the 90s to the low 100s and about the same for Friday and Saturday as well. Your latest 10 day forecast tomorrow 91 degrees, but again heat indices upwards of 100 over the next couple of days. Chance for showers and thunderstorms by Friday morning, clearing things out by Friday afternoon, the first day of summer into the mid 90s. Then for Saturday to kick off the weekend, partly cloudy skies 91 and some storms moving in Saturday night through Sunday morning. Cooler by Sunday afternoon and more showers and storms by early next week. Thank you for catching up with Two Works for You. I'm Erin Conrad.